Hey everybody, it's Dagan again, back with another Beard Proc Review, and we're going to be talking about another company that's recently rebranded, you know, reformulated, and all that good stuff. So if you have not tried this company before, or you've tried the, their old blend and have not tried the new blend, you're going to want to see this video. And we're talking about Weather Beard Supply. So let's roll that beautiful beard footage, and we'll be right back. Everybody, like I said, my intro to my intro, we're going to be talking about Weather Bear Supply Company. This is a company I've already reviewed before, and I will link a, 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 the snap for that video at the end of this video, so you can go watch that as well. But again, like I said, he has rebranded, you know, kept the same name, but he's rebranding, you know, changes labeling, reformulated, things like that. So we're going to talk about that in this review. But first of all, Let's get into the pricing real quick. He has a one ounce oil for $19.99, a two ounce butter and a two ounce bomb for $17.99. And if you want to get a bundle of two, like an oil bomb, oil butter is $34.99. If you want to get all three, oil butter bomb is $49.99. He also sells soaps and solid colognes. And once again, I will leave a description, uh, you know, a link to his website in the description below as well as to his Instagram. Now when it comes to presentation, here's what his balls currently look like now. So I think, see, they're pretty cool labeling. Has all the information you want on, the, on these uh, bottles. You got the profile, the ingredients, you know, all the other good information about this, the product. So overall, and as you can see, I actually got three bundles. I mean, yeah, three uh, oil but, uh, butter bundles. So I got the Lakeside Lodge, I think you see they are color coded and also got the Sierra Sunset. So you can to, I like how it is color coded. So you can see, see it, you know, pick it up pretty quick, you know, especially if you have multiple combos of his products. So overall, really, really nice labeling. And I got Southbound. And we'll talk about the individual scents here a little bit later in the review. So that is the presentation. Really awesome look. Uh, really love the new labeling they has. Just really amazing. Uh, great job there. All right. So when it comes to the ingredients and the consistency, the ingredients in his oils are uh, a persistent oil, a hoba oil, hemp seed oil, sunflower oil, fractionated coconut oil, metal foam seed oil, shea nut oil, castor oil, and then the fragrances for the scent. And let me go show you the consistency. And then, you know, it also has the restricted tops on it. So let me show you that. All right, I can see there's a little bit more of the medium thick oil. And when it comes to the ingredients for the beard butter, it is shea butter, abyss assistant oil, a hobo oil, hemp seed oil, sunflower oil, fractionated coconut oil, metaphene, Metafoam seed oil, uh, shea nut oil, castor, and the fragrances for the scent. And when it comes for the consistency and what it looks like, here's what it looks like. You know, it comes out really nice and easy, nice and creamy. You know, breaks down really nice and quick. So really, really love that. Really great job on that consistency. Uh, it's really amazing. All right, so when it comes to the scents, like I said, I have three on go over here. Uh, but also, I would like to notate here, like here on the front bottle where it says, you know, Lakeside Lodge, it says clean, nautical, and of course, my camera won't focus. There you go. And herbal. So I think that's a pretty nice little detail that add to the labeling. But when it comes to the scent, uh, Pacific Scent Profile for Lakeside Lodge, he has listed crushed, crushed sage, salty air, driftwood, earthy vetiver, juicy citrus fruits, and fresh teakwood. Now, what I get out of Lakeside Lodge, I get I do get that sage first. Then the rest of it, it it's just like you're sitting next to the, to the uh, you know Lakeside. You know, get that 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 uh, oceanic air type feel to it. I mean, I know Lake's not ocean, but 
that's what I get for me. You know, get the kind of salty air uh, mixed with that, that driftwood and stuff. So it kind of feels like you're in there by the lake, but you know, it has that mixed in with that sage. I get that sage as a top note, though. I mean, overall, I really, I really enjoy the scent too. And Sierra Sunset says, zesty, relaxing, and smooth. And for its specific scent profile is tangy lemon, juicy orange, fresh eucalyptus, smooth bourbon, warm vanilla, and toasted coconut flakes. So why get out of theory of sunset is I do get that zestiness of, you know, those that lemon and the, the orange and all that. So I get I get that zestiness of that. And then I start to get that uh, smoothness of the vanilla and the toasted coconut. So I do kind of get that profile as it goes through and just really, really awesome scent there. And when it comes to southbound, it says sweet, calming, and crisp. So the actual scent profile for that, he has listed fresh pickled, uh, sorry, fresh picked blackberries, sugared pecans, smooth sandalwood, rich amber, and crisp autumn leaves. So while I get out of this, I do get that, that sweetness of the blackberries and the uh, sugared pecans, uh, then, then along with the, I get I do get the autumn feel of the, you know, with that amber and the autumn leaves. So I get that, that really nice autumn scent to it. So just, it's a sweet autumn scent. So I just, I really like it actually. So I enjoyed all three of these scents. Now, if I had to choose which was my favorite out of all these three, it's actually kind of a hard pick, though. Um, but really, right now, I would say Lakeside Lodge would be my favorite at this point. Now, if we were in uh, the fall, I would say Southbound. So, But out of all these three, if right now, Lakeside Lodge is my, my best. And like I said, if Autumn, it would be uh, Southbound. So really enjoyed all these scents. So when it comes to the Phil and Beard, like I said, I have reviewed this company before, and I will link that video at the end of this video so you can go watch that so you can see my – actually, you know, watch the, my thoughts of that. But I will kind of mention that, you know, his, his old blend, I, I, I didn't really have an issue with the oil when it comes to his old blend, but in, and when it comes to his butter, uh, I did mention that the butter, you know, did soften my beard up, but it did not last all day. You know, it kind of went away. Um but probably about halfway through the day, I think it was. So uh, when it comes to his new blend, though, it's really, really improvement. I really, really enjoyed these products and really happy, uh, glad, and tried his new products. So again, when it comes to the oil of his new blend, definitely did this job, you know, kept my skin nice and nourished, never had a problem with the itchiness. And when it comes to the beard, it definitely kept my beard nice and soft all day. So really, really, really enjoyed this, this, this new blend. And when it comes to the beard butter, it's definitely, a, like I said, it's definitely, a, definitely big, 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 big improvement over his old blend. You know how it worked for me. Uh, his new blend, you know, definitely nice. Left my beard nice and soft all day. You know, it didn't fade away like this, the old blend did for me uh, with its old blend. So, but his new blend, like I said, left my beard nice and soft all day. So, really, really enjoyed this. So, again, if you have not tried Weatherbeard. Yeah, you know, I would highly recommend you trying Weatherbeard. You know, really, really great products after his rebrand. You know, what how it worked for me. So, and also if you have tried Weatherbeard, but you have not tried his new blend, um, I think you'll definitely enjoy his new blend, especially if you're like me and, and his old old blend, especially for the butter of his old blend, did not work as good for you. Uh, definitely need to try out his new blend. So, like I said, it was just. Whole, whole bunch, you know, 100% better for me how it works. So I just really, really enjoy this blend. So once again, if you have not tried it, please do go check Corey out. And like the kid said, I will have a link to his website and his Instagram in the description below. So it's pretty good to check it out. So once again, remember, keep your beards healthy. And until next video. Mm -hmm.